the Dallas Mavericks, 32 and 23. What's their grade? I'd say B. Um, I feel like this is just about where I, I expected them to be. They're still like middle of the pack of the Western Conference. Um, like Kyrie, as great as he is, he's not like moving the needle enough for a team like the Mavericks to get to that upper echelon where, I mean, you'd expect to be when you have somebody like Luca, which I feel like at, at the end of the day, in a few years, he's going to ask out of there and it's going to be one of those things. Like, I know Mark Cuban wants to try to keep him there for life, like uh, Dirk, but he's going to get tired of not winning and they're not going to win anything in Dallas while he's there. So um, I think teams are starting to like – review and do paperwork and see like, all right, what would we have to give up to get Luca in maybe a year or two? I could see the Knicks even looking at that, like waiting on him to ask out to being like, all right, this is the guy, this is the guy that we're going after. So um, the Mavericks, they're having a good season. I mean, you can't scoff at 33 and 22, but for Luca to be able to stay and, you know, you want him to be a maverick for life. You need a little more. So, you think the trades that they did at the trade deadline is actually going to make an impact? The PJ Washingtons and uh, the what's his name Gafford. Gafford. I mean Gafford. That was a really good trade that they made. I think he adds another element to that team, like pick and roll action, and defensively it, it makes them a little better because um, you can't roll with a rookie. Uh, moving forward. I mean, he's going to be good, but I feel like Gafford gives you a little more experience. And then PJ Walker, you can spread the floor a little bit more around Luca. Like he adds a, a four that can shoot threes and, you know, a secondary score right next to him that, um, you know, Maxi Kleber is not really as good as PJ Walker, in my opinion. So it, once they get up to speed, I feel like that, that PJ Walker trade is going to, uh, Walker. P.J. Washington trade is going to be even – look even better. What well, grade you give them, Greg? Oh, shit. Probably uh, I'd say a B, too. I'd probably say a B. Um, they, they've been all right. Maybe even a C plus. You didn't, they, they played all right. I think they, kicked, you know, they survived the situation where Kyrie almost breaking his leg because Dwight oh, Powell fell on him or whatever. Um, so they've been okay. But, you know, they're another team that's just – they're not winning a championship, and they're really in a bad situation because the Kyrie and Luka marriage is not a good one for obvious reasons. I don't have to get into. So, yeah, I, I, I don't – it's really because of Kyrie, by the way. Um, but also Luka uh, can be problematic. Um, but, yeah, you know, I, I think I'd give them a B and a B plus because if they've treaded water, I think a B is probably more acceptable than a B plus, honestly. So I'd say B. I talked myself out of it on live on, on air. 